Hi, and welcome. For those who haven't watched our channel from the beginning, my mom was diagnosed with Lewy body dementia in the spring of 2021. She moved in with us so I could be her caregiver. My mom's diagnosis is the reason we fostered and then adopted Sadie Grace. We needed some happiness in our lives. We needed something to help us cope with our grief and our stress and our fears surrounding an illness as ugly as this one is. Our one-eyed Shih Tzu rescue dog has been and continues to be the silver lining to our sorrows. If you've been following our journey these past few months, you've probably noticed that my mom has been growing weaker and more frail. Sadie, come on. Let, let the leash go, mom. Here. She's also become less talkative because her dementia has caused her to suffer speech difficulties. You coming? Come on. If you watched our raspberry picking adventure in July, and our visit to the Sunflower Sanctuary in August, you know that she was near the point of collapse on both of those excursions from sudden bouts of weakness that came on out of nowhere. That's why in our last video on the walk by the river, I brought a wheelchair with us because I didn't want to risk her falling. If you keep watching, you'll understand why this peaceful walk on that warm October day will forever be very special to us. It was quite literally, the calm before the storm. Hey, you guys. Isn't this beautiful? Yeah, it's gorgeous. Aren't we having a wonderful afternoon in October? Sure are. Feels like August? Our kind of day. I think the geese are happy too. Listen to them. Yep. I firmly believe that Sadie Grace has known all along that my mom is unwell. With me, she is playful and wildly affectionate and oh, so vocal. But with my mom, she is more quiet and subdued and sensitive. She walks into her room the way you would walk into a sleeping baby's nursery. She almost tiptoes around her. Witnessing this little dog show my mom the gentlest, most sincere and tender form of love has been beautiful and humbling. In recent weeks, Sadie Grace has demonstrated what I believe to be outright concern for my mom. It was written all over her face this particular morning. I could see it clear as day. That's her saying that she wants you to feel better. She was worried about her grandma. And that she loves you. And she had reason to be. Mm -hmm. Are you worried about grandma? Oh. She knows you're having a rough morning. That's nice. Look at that. I feel I'm going to get better. Good. That's what we want. We want you to feel like you're going to get better. I have to. Yes. That's what we all want, Mom. You can tell everybody you know I'm going to get better. Okay, I will. I will tell them. Everybody wants you to get better. Nobody never heard of that silly name. Right? What silly name? Dementia. 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 Oh, Dementia. people have heard of it. 
A lot of people haven't heard of Lewy body dementia, but everybody has heard of dementia before. And everybody knows that dementia is a miserable, miserable disease to suffer with. Can you give me a Kleenex, please? Yeah. You're worried about Grandma, huh? Oh, you little sweetie. Mm. I, gotta, I gotta lay down, though. Okay. I gotta lay down. Okay. Well, we'll let you have a rest. My mom was sadly admitted to hospital the day after I filmed this segment of her and Sadie Grace. She became disoriented during the night when we were sleeping and took a fall in her bedroom. Robin and I both heard the sound of her body crash to the floor and we went running to help her. Thankfully, she didn't break any bones despite being in pain, but she entered a state of delirium that severely impacted her ability to speak, eat, move, and comprehend. with you mom I'm right with you okay yeah. don't be afraid I love you you're so loved Thankfully, in recent days, my mom's health has improved, but she remains in hospital. For the last 21 days, I've been visiting her in hospital every single day. Robin and Anderson also visit her when their schedules allow. We love you. I know you do. We miss you. So glad we get to still see you every day. Yeah. Yeah. See you later, Grandma. I love you. My mom and I are both former teachers. We talked about doing a few dedicated videos on the subject of Lewy body dementia to help educate others, but we didn't get very far. We both thought we had more time. I have little clips here and there that I started recording months ago so I'd like to release them over the next little while. It's my way of honoring the bravery of my mom because she didn't have to speak about this horrible disease, but she wanted to. She chose to. She wanted to share some of what she was experiencing to help educate others about Lewy body dementia and also to demonstrate how the love of a dog can be an incredible source of comfort. We never set out to be a channel about dementia, and that isn't going to be our focus moving forward. But I hope you'll watch what's coming next. I know it will mean a lot to my mom, and honestly, it will mean a lot to me too. In the meantime, be sure to check out our YouTube shorts, as there are an abundance of cute and lighthearted videos starring Little Miss Sadie Grace. That will hopefully make you smile. I'm going to keep making them because they are a healthy distraction right now from the seriousness that we as a family are dealing with. My mom, more than anyone, would want us to keep our chins up and smile through our tears whenever possible. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and feel free to comment below. We'd love to hear from you.
You can also subscribe to our channel. Be sure to hit the bell button so you'll be alerted each time we post a new video. Be well, and we'll see you next time.